Insane matchup so far. A complete trouncing of Navi by Flipside on cash. They return the favor on overpass, and then one of the best matches I've seen in, in a little while on, on Cobble. Yeah, uh, we were expecting a close contest, but just the way it went back and forth, I guess, surprised everyone. And uh, yeah, flip, flip side looking very strong at this point. And going to Mirage, I think uh, it's a map where both teams are going to be, they're going to be feeling confident. Um, I think Navi is probably going to be a bit rattled there. They they took the advantage in a situation where they want to save round late on Cobblestone, but just wasn't able to capitalize on that situation. And we've been talking up simple all night. The way his T-sides have gone and the way T-sides typically go for flip side. And this is another map where that's exactly the case. So keep an eye out for how many CT rounds they get if they start on that side. Or how many T-rounds they get if they start on the attack. But it's Navi who's typically got the better record on this map. They're usually the team that's quite dynamic. Guardian, so proficient. Usually plays it off toward the window. He's been playing a little more passively lately. And again, I mean, you got a player like Edward who's been on fire tonight too. That only helps. Definitely. But on, from flip side point of view, a player to watch for many reasons, but also on Mirage is going to be, again, simple just for the fact that just watch out for his CT play. He plays very aggressively there on short of B, and uh, just he's just going to be there and uh, have a huge presence in middle through that short B, and uh, I think that's going to be one of the fundamental things on flip side CT side. And that's that's a great point. And again, it's his entry so far tonight that it, with the AK that's been remarkable. We saw some massive headshots toward B. On, well, we saw massive headshots everywhere on Cash, let's be real. And then, of course, on B, more so on Cobble. If you can get those going on the A entry for their T side, it's going to be hell for Hellraisers. Hellraisers. Hell for Hellraisers. It was in my mind. Hell for Navi to try and hold that off. The difference is that smokes are more commonly utilized. They may be able to counter that out by getting up close with Simple and uh, and taking a better approach in that regard. And it, Star X is the coach. He's the one that's going to be able to have the bird's eye view on the perspective. We'll see if he's going to be on the fly and changing that up on how they address him. Because right now, the way he's playing, you have to almost counter him. You have to almost play the one-man game against Simple tonight. Yeah, I was talking with LGB in Copenhagen after they got stomped by Flipside on Mirage, actually. And uh, Pauly told me that the way they played early on on T-side, they just went and stopped LGB's defense in the middle of first in the first few rounds, and then when they started playing heavy middle, all they did, they would ju were just running up on a site and uh, taking it out or right away, so it's going to be interesting to see how, how Flipside really plays that T-side. Of course, <clears throat> excuse me, Flipside also loved to go to the double op setup on this map. The question is, do you want to take Simple off the rifle tonight? Because that's where all his, his success has come. They also have Markalov who can run that op if they choose to, but World Edit for sure will get the op out CT side at the very least, if not to do battle in mid on the T side as well. So if the economy works in their favor, they'll go to it. And usually you're going to see an op on the T side at least once due to the money bonus that would come in when they start to lose, unless it goes back and forth the whole time, in which case it doesn't matter. They'll be getting enough rounds if that's the case. Yeah, this map here enables you to use two ops on, on defense very effectively. But Twitch chat again. Yeah. They're just slowly... They're, they're cursing Navi here. <laughs> slowly pushing more and more toward flip side. Well, fair enough. They're not, never wrong. They were right about TSM versus Fnatic. They're going to be... Well, I don't know if they're going to be right, but so far they've got the advantage. It's 2-1. So the tournament on the line for Navi flip side potentially could go forward against Fnatic and... We'll find out. Again, Navi could quickly tie this up as well. And then we'll have Inferno, which will be back and forth. Both teams are good on that. I mean, this map pool really does suit them. It does. I think it's um, it's actually pretty favorable for both sides. I think the only map really that I initially felt was definitely Navi's was Overpass. And as we saw, they really stomped flip side there on Overpass. But all, all, all the other maps, I think, were, were rather equal. Even though they didn't play them equal, obviously Navi was well, a bit slow on cash yeah, yeah, to wake yeah. up more than anything. But what I mean is like mm -hmm. the way they both feel about these maps, it's not like they're going to be really uncomfortable on any of them, except Overpass, I felt, was definitely one where Flipside was probably going to be less comfortable on. No, and I agree, and we, and we talked about that too, because the last time those two teams met on cash, it actually went Navi's way, but Knife is going to start. Do we want the finish Knife round? I think Korean is way more entertaining. Okay, we'll see. I haven't done it in a while. 
So, place your bets. Knife round gonna get started and already they're working up in toward the A site right now. World that gonna be the first one up over top of Tetris. Still looking at the face of Guardian and they stare each other down. So pretty the eyes and they want to adore them a little bit longer as the iris expands as that knife comes in and the pain's already in place. They're both down on health and now they're gonna run toward the A site. Markaloff does get Edward, but Zeus comes right back and the God of War showing off that he can use his sword as much as a gun and that's gonna make it back to a four on four situation. But the damage is still going the way of Navi right now. Cancel that back. How come there is a decoy egg going out? That will do damage when it explodes. However, no one's close enough by to make it impactful on the round as Markaloff does get Guardian. Now it's just flaming left. In fact, he's going to go down. It's uh, Seas who actually finds himself all by himself. One on three. He's going to get the first. Can he get more? He does get two. And if he makes this a one on three, it would be an absolutely incredible Korean round because it's going to be as exciting as ever. Bonding now with 12 HP. He's down the disadvantage, but he gets him. He dodges that first wipe and he goes back into it. And now flip side tactics have three out of the four knife rounds and they'll start out on the CT side. There you go. Flip side, they get the advantage of choosing CT and they, they go for it. And uh, as we were talking about, we get to see that aggression from uh, Flipside on their CT. I think they, they seem to opt for the aggression on middle from both sides, actually. Um, on T side, a lot of teams you see the defo default strategy is going to be taking over that mid and then working your way up from there. Uh, but Flipside really does work that mid as CT very well. A lot of it is contributed by a simple play on short B. Um, he just plays it immensely aggressively and um, just makes it work. Time after time, kind of interesting to see here how, what kind of medicine does the Navi have against that? Well, that's the big question. How do they counter it right away? And, yeah. Uh, we'll see how things start out. It's been the start of both maps, or the first two maps rather, when things got out of hand. That one team came out flat. Of course, last time things were pretty equal, and that's the way it went the whole time. So it could be an indication early on of what kind of match we're going to see. Definitely. Navi definitely want to have take the. Uh, Early rounds here and uh, be the uh, the team to take the pace, but um, at the same time, Simple and the boys have their say in this as well. So, pace around on its way. And already shots fired. World Edit putting damage out toward middle. Hasn't connected with anyone just yet. Now he does. Gets the headshot onto Flamey. And in fact, it's Edward that drops just before that. Flamey now just joins him in the grave, but World Edit's already found. Some damage in return. Seas does find Blade. That brings it back to within one, and Seas goes down immediately after. Bondix the one with the kill. Zeus comes back one more, but here's Simple. He's already arrived, and it's a double for him to close out the round. And flip side, CT side have the first round, and that's very important for them. Yeah, and early, early presses in middle from Simple again. That is three frags for him. World Edit helped him out well, though. I think he was playing in window, and uh, he just gave that assistance to uh, Simple because he could have gone down actually very early, early in that round and that could have been a difference maker here for Na'Vi but, but it's flip side that takes the early lead. So early lead important, very important, specifically on a map where flip side's defense has been slightly weaker. They've made a number of comebacks including one against Liquid in the ESL qualifier. Where they just take advantage of a relentless A push. Zeus this time will be the first to drop. It's Bondic with the FAMAS to get the kill. But look at the presence inside Connector. They'll come back around. They're smoked off. Edward gets the bomb down. Yeah. Flipside just gave away the bomb side. They, they let, let Navi plant the bomb. It actually wasn't ever my mistake. It was Navi in general, though. As we see, it was seized. Edward was pushed forward, and that's where Blade found him and put him in the grave. Simple's going to go back. Seize goes in, but Simple's down. Guardian gets him, and now it's World Edit to come in. He's found two, and they'll get this defuse. So only one kill goes out for Navi, but they utilize smokes to the full effect. And remember, it's them that are so good with smokes on this A site. That's money in the bank for them. Yeah. Navi was actually hoping for this side to play more aggressively and use those tech nines in their favor, but... Flip side playing it smart and giving away that A side and just relying on the on the retake, making it work and uh, just relying on the longer distance shooting, being in favor of the rifles over the Tech Nines. That's flip side two nothing and uh, at least now we got the plant. They're going to be forcing it up again. Could be a questionable answer. I hope they really have something planned out here. So one AK up. That's seized. There's a lot of weight on his shoulders right now. That brings him back down to equalize up the money to... Now he's already down to 35 HP. He's, he's given out that AK to Guardian. Not a bad decision to hand it off. As the counter flash will push World Edit back deeper inside jungle. And he's just looking for anyone to cross over. There's no smoke directly in front of him, so that gives him the shot on the angle. And there's the first man out. World Edit makes good of it. Seize does go down. He looks for more damage out to the player on Palace, but Simple's the one that gets both kills before Flamey gets him back with that Deagle on the headshot. 
He's low HP regardless, but makes good of the shot, and that's Markov to close off the round. Zeus goes down, and flip side, get that one. And again, that force pie leaves them so broken over on the Navi side that we might get four rounds going to flip side before we establish some sort of presence from Navi. Yeah, that's more than likely at this point. Uh, Navi would have needed a early kill there from Seized in that round for it to be a viable situation for them, but he's an inability to contribute. Um, eventually, just costs a round. And uh, flip side, take, making a statement early on here that they're here to play, and uh, just very nice CT play so far from flip side. Bondic catches Flamey, so again, flip side, the man advantage. Bondic looks for more. He spots one player dropping out of Palace, but he actually does collect him in the end through the smoke, and he's going to get three as Guardian drops. Blade contributes with that AK just before that, and I do believe World Edit had a shot with the op just before that as well. So four now, but look at Guardian, already onto the op. No head armor to go with it, but five, or pardon me, four AKs. Mathematics don't make sense there. That would be six, but AKs to support it. Yeah, I think this is going to be the first battle off middle coming up next. Flipside has really proven that the shop is close on A so far. Let's see what kind of an answer Navi have here. Seems like Guardian is actually going to be sneaking up towards A, and uh, he's going to try to get a sneaky kill. Meanwhile, Flipside is very heavily aggressive here in middle. Shot already out, traded this time. So now they've got a way into the site. Smoke's late to get there. Blade catches seized as a result, but here comes Guardian over the top. Make it one. Whiffs on the second. So close. That would have taken down Simple and completely cracked open A. Instead, Flamey's still late to get there. And they're a man down. Zeus, meanwhile, has pushed into CT. That might catch off Blade. In fact, it does. He's crawling through, and Flamey gets Markalov. They pull it back, but it's still the most worthy opponent that they've got to go up against. It's Simple that's still alive, and he's on 95 HP. Has the M4, but he's split up. And Flamey goes all the way back over toward mid and back to A because Zeus calls that he sees Simple leaving. They'll get this plant. They're going to have to. So Simple goes all the way toward the apartments. He still thinks it's on B. And the question is, does he go for the retake or not? He does like have reasonable money. He's got 6,800, so I think he will. He's going to go for it. He's got so much confidence tonight. Why wouldn't you? Yeah, when you're when you're playing as well as he is. He can pretty much take any, any battle he wanted to. So back up from the top of Connector already. Looks toward the window. Still checking every single corner. Has to be dead sure of exactly where both are before time expires for too much longer. He'll smoke his way in. Fires off on the ramp. That's usually where they're playing, but it's not planted for there. Simple can't find it. He tries to go for the defuse, and Flamey's already got the better of it. Navi in the round. One on the board for them. Yeah. Nice reactional play from Navi. The call from middle probably came to Zeus and uh, Guardian, uh, who were going towards A, that there's they have heavy mid presses. That meant Zeus just ran out, got the sole guy on A. That opened uh, up the bomb side, and uh, they capitalized on the situation. Just good communication and instinctive plays. Again, playing in favor of Navi here. And this time Navi sets up for picks. Flamey's your solo player on A, seized. Solo in the B apartments. He's got the bomb, though. And he's already falling back. Shots rattle off at mid. Simple smoked. He's actually going to go to the ladder. He can't peek out from the catwalk. But World Edit's not inside window. He's inside the connector. He's actually watching toward the underpass right now with the ops. So he's got to be careful because Zeus is coming up slowly. His only saving grace would be simple to pop out from window right now, but he's still waiting to top ladder because he's not sure if they're going to wrap on a catwalk. And if he drops, he can't get back in behind them quite so quickly. So he has to stay patient. He has to wait for the angle to fall into his favor. If he overplays this, they've got an opportunity to run directly past him onto B. And instead, he goes back to the doorway. This is the right call because Edward might walk into it. There he is, and he does. Simple takes him down, and now he falls back up. Now he's got a chance to read the round. He's got the control back their way. It's a one-man advantage. Flashbang to go out. That catches off Zeus. And another one as well, he blinds him up. And Simple, he can't connect it. He's done all the damage, and he had the full advantage, but this time he whiffs on the shot. We haven't said that much tonight, but in this time, it will not go his way. And somehow Zeus gets all the way back inside of the underpass. Markalov's going to chase him down. He does get the kill in the end. Seize comes back, but it's a one on three, and he's got very low HP. World Edit closes him off, and flip side go right back. It's five to one. Yeah, again, Navi had the read on the heavy, heavy mid presses from flip side, but still unable to uh, capitalize on the knowledge. Flipside just playing it very nicely and uh, Flamey within that shot. Definitely two major contributions and in, in outcome of the round and Flipside really, really doing a solid job so far and uh, they're dictating the play. Really putting it up and uh, making it hard for Navi so far on the T side of the barrage. 
Back to the pistols. Flamey's got the deagle. We'll see if he can do something rather remarkable with it. World Edit fires all the way through that smoke, just hoping someone's misplaced inside Palace and Simple's already found seized. And look at the aggression in mid. You talked about this. He's already down mid. He's pushing all the way up. In fact, he's actually going to back down. Cat just gets himself back in position, but... Yeah, that's the right play at this point. They they, they know they're Navi saving, and they got the man advantage, so... That's the right play. Fall back and just play your position. Doesn't give away the M4 either by doing that. Yep. Because they are coming mid. They're all on that corner. Flamey, Edward, Guardian. The first two. Already around. Push to the left side behind the boxes. Edward's just going to wait. He's the one with the bomb. And it's Flamey that wants into the corner. He's got that deagle. He's going to be looking for the magic shot toward Simple, who's back toward the get-right spot. Slowly adjusts the angle and falls back out. Bondic waiting with the fire to delay the push from Palace. Zeus is the only one there. And he's getting impatient. He wants to go. He's got to wait for his teammate to get to court quick. Connector, though, excuse me, as Zeus does pop out. Blade spots him up. Bondic does find Zeus before he goes any further. So the man in shadow comes out on top. Simple's going to catch Guardian Edwards down. It's a double for Simple. He's on one HP, though. They took him very low, but they haven't got him off the map, and he's got the bomb secured. So Flamey's all that's left, and he's got the Deagle. Goes for the jump shot. That's your low HP man, and simple, but Bondic gets the kill in the end, and now it's six for flip side. Navi, no success on the eco, but money back in the pocket. Let's head to the store and buy some candy. AK's out. Well, let's see if Navi is really caught up on what flip side is doing, which is they're, they're just being very aggressive there in the middle every single round. Is that going to make Gnavi do an early push on A? Or are they just going to keep on pushing towards the middle? Seems like they're going to be doing something similar they've done it before. You off flip side. Again, very aggressive. Edward gets the trade, though Simple this time does go down. In fact, Edward gets the double, so this is looking good for Navi. Markolov brings it back the way of Flipside, or at least evens it back up. In fact, he goes further. World Edit's going to take down Flamey, and it's all up to C's to get this kill on B to keep the round in place, but it's not going to happen. Flipside are holding strong. Their defense looking great this map, and that's scary for Navi because let's not forget it's the T side where they really come alive. Zeus lurking. He wants to get one more. Does catch Bondic. But he doesn't have the bomb. It's way back toward mid. He has to go all the way back to get it. He's got time to do so. 55 seconds to work with. And low HP on both flip side players. It's still winnable because the more time that expires, the more they've got to split up. World Edit is watching through the vents, hoping he can spot the cross. But unfortunately, he only sees just to that wall. The angle doesn't exist there. And it's up to Zeus. Where does he go? Looks like it's going to be toward A. Yep. So he's going to make the right call. Up connector, he goes slowly. This now means World Edit has to start guessing. There's 25 seconds. It's been 30 since he's been last spotted. So he'll work out. He'll go directly in toward the vent. They hear him planning. They know that smoke's out. So where does he fall? Because he's going to get spotted right away. World Edit can't connect. Zeus actually goes back. And now this round is all his to win. World Edit doesn't hit the shot. Gets countered. And Markolov on 25 HP has to come in in a one-on-one -on -one post plant with Zeus with more than enough time to fall inside the ramp. So Zeus has full control. Fire goes out. That'll prevent his peak, but Markolov doesn't get struck directly on it. He's actually still searching for it, so the flames will extinguish before he can even hold the defuse. That means he has to bait out the peak. Gets the shot. Does he still have time? Yep. I think he does. He does. He does. Great win from Markolov. And that means flip side extend the lead by six, up to seven rounds total. All the trade kills are going in favor of flip side at this point. All over the map. Which means that that middle area is in the lockdown right now. It's just not going to happen for Navi as we speak. And uh, it's not going to be a sustainable way of trying to pick up rounds if they're going to be relying on one on twos or one on three situations like that. Where Zeus was arguably the the player with the advantage but wasn't wasn't able to pull it off. You know, I think this is going to be Navi's time to switch up their play and uh, try to do a, more of a direct attack to one of the sites. Off, rattling off shots preemptively in toward the B tunnels. The B apartments. The smoke's already out. Need to go in. No one's going to be close enough to take the damage. They're just posted back inside the courtyard. And it's going to be a Tech 9 rush. Flamey going back to his Deagle, hoping he can get them. They're going to run right through the fire. They don't care. Edward's the first in, but he's the only one, and they all stop. He goes, and they don't. And that's misorganized because Zeus now does come in from Simple. If they had gotten that kill and they were already in the site, they might get a plant, but they might anyway. Seized gets a magical shot. That's Markolov down. Flash goes out. That per prohibits World Edit from peeking off. Blade gets Zeus. 
He's counted out by Seized, and the bomb's down. They've got the man advantage, and they picked up this M4 as well. Seized is low HP. He's the one that has it. He might try and throw it off, but he's got the armor, so they'll keep it on him. There's no aim punch to keep him from having his shot and having his way with it. World Edit's going to hold this, hoping someone falls back, and they do, but he can't hit. That's the second time in two rounds he's not been able to connect on a shot, and Bondic's going to get seized. That brings it back, but look at the HP. It's three and four for Bondic and World Edit, and it looks like Navi might have this, or do they? World Edit finds Guardian. Flamey responds with your Deagle, and there it is. Mom, he just killed a man. One shot from the Deagle. Bondic goes down, and it's now up to two for Navi. Yeah, the problem there for uh, Flipside's defense was that Markelov and, and uh, Simple, they got really separated. And Simple had to fight them all on his own, and Markelov couldn't help him at all because of the smokes and the flashes. And uh, that was the big key, and there we go. Even though they were on a save, they were able to capitalize on a straight-up attack on one of the sites. And I think that is something they should be utilizing, but at this point it seems like they, they just want to keep contesting that middle area. And I think it's going to be very hard for them, considering how well Simple is playing right now. Just look at him. He's just playing so aggressively. Now we're going to see a bit more mid-presence from Na'Vi where they've got the rifles to work with. And Guardian's already tagged up, though. That's the big thing. Down to 37. And shotgun for World Edit. He is inside connector, but he won't be able to hold Catwalk quite so easily, even though he can see over the smoke. And that's scary, because Zeus is looking directly at him. Fires off that shot. No way. Not from that range. Does get him down to 61, but it's not a one-shot kill as it would be if he were up close. So Zeus still has a chance to use this AK, and the smoke's actually going to give him a chance to get even further around the corner. It's going to be a big push. Flashes himself, though. It's going to be a big push coming up here for Na'Vi. And they're already in. They're already down the backside. Markalov has to play the reverse angle. Simple just gets there, and he's actually already count countered as Flamey gets the kill onto him. Markalov's doing the job, though. Look at him from Catwalk already, too. Finally, Zeus gets him back, and Blade's going to burn away the others, and Blade's going to get more than that world, and it finally does use the shotgun, and it's up to eight. Flip side, holding strong on the back of Markalov. Yeah, Markalov really showing off this match as well. A lot of crucial kills in crucial situation. Had he not been able to take those kills, it would have been all Na'Vi on that round. Even the third kill, even even though it went to, went to Blade because of that Molotov. Just nice plays from Markalov here. Keeping flip side on, on, on the lead. And uh, a very broken buy from Na'Vi coming up here. Broken indeed. Again, Flamey, though, going for this Deagle. And we saw him get that double kill in the second round they picked up. He's got confidence in it. There's no question about that. Navi going for another P-Push. They had so much so much success last time there. Opting to do it once again. And they'll walk it into the B-Halls. Like you say, they want to go that direction. Simple this time will be the one on cap. Markalov's back in his default by the van. In fact, he's on top of it. He's riding the roof. He's not even going to get closer than that. He'll get on the balcony. He's got to be careful, though. This smoke's slowly going to disintegrate. So he actually falls off it. There's no one to support him if he gets caught up close early. You'll often need a second player to hold the attention so he can walk out and get the slaughter, but they're already falling into his crosshair. Seized is the first to go. Markalov holds strong. Simple's going to get it from the other side of the site. So they've each found one. Markalov finds another. World edit onto Zeus, and now it's all just flaming. He has picked up the AK. Does get the first. Make it two now. He gets World edit as well. 42 HP still left, and Markalov's just too patient. There's no pulling him out from the back side of the jail. And now he's got nine rounds for his team. Flip side, nine round CT on Mirage. Doesn't happen often, and you have to say with them on series point, this is uh, boding well for their chances. But as you can see here, the biggest difference here in between this round and the other round where Navi won this B push was the lack of smokes that separated Markalov and Simple. Now they could create a, create a uh, crossfire, and uh, they just demolish Navi. That's going to put Navi on a save around here. So it's a potential 10 to 5 score line. It's going to be very good for the website at this time. Shots already coming in. Fast round. Big exchange on A already. Edward at least gets one for Navi with these pistols, but that's all he's going to get. Upside hold true. And Navi right now do not have an answer and no money going their way because they split it up. It was four rounds with a win, three rounds, then a win, and three rounds now with nothing else behind it. It means they haven't got a money bonus, so even yeah. the economy's been really rough against them. The wins they're getting are actually playing into flip side in that regard. Yeah, we haven't seen a simple, uh, single ace trap for Navi yet. Let's see if they have something here coming up on this round. And there's your first shot. World Edit gets it. Make it two. Double peak. Huge play from him, and he gets three. How quick is he? 
unbelievable off movements, and Zeus goes down the last one, but he's the one that leads the way now, and he's, the, I mean, you've got Simple, yeah, we've talked about him all night. Let's not discount World Edit. This guy is also a masterful skill that you've got to take note of. By now, if you don't know this guy's name, you haven't been watching Counter-Strike recently. He is so strong. It definitely is, and he's showing up here. He's being, he's being the top fragger on the server right now, and uh, making a lot of big kills. Meanwhile, Navi, their plays are really lackluster so far here in Mirage. I'm actually very surprised at the way they're playing. Their eight, their middle plays have been d demolished by Flipside, and now their A attack. That one there, that was not what I was asking for. I was asking for good smokes, good flashes, coordinated, well timed. We didn't really see any of that. They were just running, running chickens to the crosshairs of uh, Flipside. And that means they're back to pistols again, because again, yeah. the money bonus isn't building up, so yeah, flip side are winning all the right rounds. They are under heavy pressure, Nafi is right now. They're going to be potentially 12-2 down, and uh, it's not a good situation to be in. It's a force, sort of a force buy. It's simple. He's not going to stop. He's already found two more. That's Edward seized. At World Edit collects Zeus. At least Guardian gets one back. There's your Tech 9. Bondic drops. Blade's going to catch Flamey. Well, that it doubles up as well. To be so he and Simple just continuing on. Yeah, Navi seems like a team that's really, really frustrated at this time. They don't see get anything going for them, and uh, these type of buys and the the strategies they're they're executing right now are just underwhelming. And uh, it's going to be an easy job for Flipside so far. It's, it, it Unfortunately, it seems like we're not going to have a close contest here on on Mirage as it is right now. Well, that's the thing. It is not looking close. We're back to how the score lines were in map number one, but it's a Cinderella story for Flipside. Question is, how long can they get a, get on in this map before the clock like, strikes midnight? And Na'Vi come alive because, again, traditionally these two teams don't have this sort of matchup. It's usually Na'Vi that holds the ropes against Flipside. Not tonight, not the way they're playing. They have been excellent individually, not to mention as a team. And Bondix up close. This gives Flamey not much room to work with on this entry. Zeus is posted in the palace behind him. They've dropped the bomb back toward the horseshoe. And Simple falls off Cat. He knows Edward's up close. That one flash does catch him off, and he doesn't want to take the battle with Guardian. He's playing calculated at this point. And again, huge problem for Navi. They have barely any nades to work with. Guardian versus Simple. One on one, and he gets both. He actually fires toward Connector first, and then Guardian walks into his crosshair. So it's an easy double. And now World Edit's going to catch Flamey. These two guys, you might as well remove everyone else not to discredit them. Let's not take away as Bondic. There you go. There's why you can't discredit them. But them alone right now are holding on to these sites magically. It's all about the trickery, and it's all C's that's left. And World Edit gets him as well. Yeah. I mean, let's just, before we jump back to us on the camera, let's just see it's 21 and 20 kills for them respectively. World Edit leads the way by one. And then it's 12, 10, and nine. But their defense, man, holy moly. Those two guys, when they are rolling together, is even more scary than Simple alone. I think it was more about Navi being lackluster there than uh, Flipside being good defense. To be honest with you, I, I, it felt like Navi were running out of ideas. And uh, especially later rounds, they were just horrible. Yeah, and where's the smokes? We, talk, I, we mentioned it actually halfway through after they went for that eco with the bomb plant, the second round, actually. Yeah. But their smokes on air... Usually textbook. They're actually the yeah, ones yeah. that set the standards. Again, I'll mention it. They were the one that came up with that three-wall smoke early that then, kaboom, now Keedstars used all the time. And, mm -hmm. and it was them that started it, not Titan. And usually they make that work at least two times a game. We didn't even see it once. Yeah, you need to try to create a wall with those smokes and uh, make it harder for the CTs to create crossfires. And uh, you could see that in that beast rat. They made it work flawlessly. But after that, they didn't see it a single time. Not once at all. It's going to be very, very tough for Navi. They're going to really pull a rabbit out of their hat if they want to come back in this match at this point. I'm sure a rabbit would be nice. It would be flattering, and it's such a cute animal, but I'm sure they'd rather pull out five kills right now in this pistol round. Nade's going to go deep. That does decent damage, actually, to Bondic. So Zeus collects the kill with the pistol, and Guardian's already found World Edit as he tries to pursue one of those CT stairs. Bomb does still go out for Flipside. That's your key. And Markolov's actually found Edward. So they have a bit of time. They've got a bit of breathing room to set up these spots. And Simple finds Guardian. Comes up from middle. He's in connector. Zeus is inside the site. Blade catches Flamey. They're pulling it back. Simple again. Yeah. <laughs> Navi had the lead. And Flipside pull it back. And with the pistol round, it's 14. This looks like Flipside tactics. Not only will they take out VP, they might take out Navi. And the way they're playing... 
Fanatic better hope they're awake. But that said, I would love to see Simple come into a land right now. Definitely. I mean, just the way Navi was so much on... Like, they, they really had that round and then just Simple happened. He just went, went through Connector and picked up all those kills. And he is right now taking Flipside over the edge here against Navi. I'm lost for words at this point for how many times he's been it's contributing nutty. as much as it, he has. It's, it's nutty. I mean... It's out of this world. It, it, a one-map performance would have been enough for me to say, great, he's done his job, and that was <laughs> impressive to watch. The fact yeah. he's been doing it all night is even more. There's your one dig from Flame. He catches out on Bondic, and they're actually going to catch Markolov as well. They swarm him. So they may give up the A site, but they secured a rifle, and that brings it back to a two-on-three. Edward's got the AK. Zeus with the scout, because Markolov got caught roaming. Bomb does go down. Edward's going to go in from jungle. He actually gets up through the, the ladder room. And Zeus is going to go through palace. So it's a big flank times two. He doesn't even go to the ramp. And Edward's found simple. This gets it back down to a two on two. There's a chance now for Navi. Blade stuck inside the site. And I don't think he's going to spot up that Zeus is behind him. And there it is. Easy scout shot. And it's all up to world edit to bait this bomb plan out. But it's on the backside. Okay, he can still see it. Just barely has the vision, but they know he's there. Zeus knows he's there. He's going to hold this off. And it's much like Hiko for Cloud9. And they'll get the defuse. Zeus gets the kill. And they pull themselves back. So it's not done just yet, but it's still very close. It is way too close, I think. It's going to be too high a climb for them to get over. And uh, at this point, it's just an inevitable scoreline. It's going to be a 16 for Flipside at some point. But yeah, just a nice nice rescue there from Edward, pretty much. He got the, got the crucial kill on Simple. Gave the bit of a lifeline for her. Navi at this point. They're going to rush it in toward B this time. Navi's going to shut them down. Blade, Markolov just walk into the spam from the A1. And already Simple's been found. The SMG gets that kill. There's no reason for them to force bite because, like yeah. you said, they've got so much time in this map to really close it out. No, no. Yeah, you, you should never start force buying in these situations when you're at 14. When you're at 14 and it's such an early stage of the uh, second half. Yeah, you just throw momentum away. Yeah, don't do it. Kids, don't do it. I knew you were going to go there. I was waiting for it. As soon as you said don't do it, I was waiting for, like, the PR message. <laughs> well, the public relations message right now is don't give Simple an AK. So far, he hasn't been able to pull one out. But he will this round. They go right back to it. Bondic's got the Galil. He's the only one without an AK. As a matter of fact, and uh, it's going to be... A set up early on the horseshoe and B. In fact, they're going to go underpass. Simple wants to get up close and try and take the battle with Zeus, who's already lurking in that direction. But is he going to get caught? He is. Simple wasn't looking. And Zeus gets him. That's an easy pickup, and that's a big big advantage for them. World Edit at least gets Edward back on the catwalk. That'll open up things at B. Markolov's still waiting. Seized is pushed up in Kitchen as well. So if they catch him, they'll be able to rush. There's still a smoke out. Do they have another? They don't. They can't use another. Okay, they do. World Edit, but he's on one HP. He's got a smoke connector if they want to rush this B. And seized now. He's pushed up. He's going to catch pass. Markolov. Yep. A lot of information for him to have at this point. And a very grim situation for Flipside in this round. It's going to need a bit of a miracle for Flipside to, flip to take this round here. So Navi might get away with one more before this is over. We do still have guns up. It would take a flawless entry from Bondic right now at Palace. His blade's still stuck inside middle. And Zeus is still in connector just waiting for him. And this is tense. When does he walk forward? Does he get the shot? He does, and he does! Oh, he wow. does! Zeus can't connect. He can't close it out. The M4 not powerful enough. So Blades opened it up. Now they can pinch on the site. Bondic has gone down. That's crucial because there's no HP left for World Edit. So they'll get away with the round. But that almost came back the other way. And they'll go back to pistols, so we should get six from Navi. So this isn't done just yet, but Flipside are still not going to feel pressured. They've got lots of breathing room. Yeah, and these rounds are being very close so far. So with that being said, I think it's just it's just too high of a climb still for Navi. But you never know. We've seen crazy things, and uh, it would not be the most crazy thing I've ever seen if uh, should Navi come back from this. Lamy and Zeus start things off again, so Navi will continue on. Anti-Eco so far looking great. Edward's going to contribute as well. That's Markolov and Edward up close. Actually, he got the pistol kill. I thought it was going to be Guardian up close. Excuse me, and Flamey closes it out. So it is flawless. No bomb plant. No kills go against them. But as we can see, AK is already coming out. And an AWP for a world, world edit. Let's see how he utilizes it. 
Is he gonna go for the mid pick and F3 try and try and take that mid control? Mid control is the thing. We haven't seen too much exchanges there because Navi couldn't really get a presence in there early on in their half. Edward and World Edit seem to want to do battle this time, and they do both have that op. But the smoke's out on the window. That forces Edit to readjust. Guardian doesn't care. He's already found the shot. World Edit goes down. Simple's got to be careful. He's underpass. Can he catch Guardian? No, it's Edward to drop down and catch him. So Simple's out. That's two rounds in a row with the AKs out that he hasn't been able to find an early kill, and that seems to be the difference right now. Navi's got it up to a two-man advantage already. Bondic stuck inside Palace. Has this AK. Will they flash Flamey in, or will he just wait outside the doorway? Looks like right now he's going to wait outside the doorway. Similar to the first half, we're seeing Navi here with your early aggression as CT in middle and uh, really taking it to the team. Making them pay for trying to take that mid control. Arkelov falls back inside apartment. Seized was pushing up. He spots him and Bonix on the way in. He's already inside him, but watch out. Flamey's below and he hasn't checked it. He has not checked it. And I fear for your life, my friend, but you almost get away with it, interestingly enough. Nonetheless, Flamey does get the kill. And that brings it back down to only two men left for flip side. Markalov and Blade. AK and AK. Molotov and Molotov and flashbangs out. One smoke as well. That bounces out toward Cat. Tries to cover them on the way in. Seized already here. Blades dropped in. He hears him go down. And Blade gets the kill. Can they get this bomb plant? They might have a chance because it's late rotations. Edwards on the flank. That's the interesting one. Because yep. they'll be able to hold out Blade, Guardian and Flamey, excuse me, if they can get into good positions. Markalov needs to read this and he hasn't. So far he hasn't. Now he will because Edward gets the first kill. Markalov brings it back and it's all on him. Can he get them to match point? He knows Guardian's lurking in and Guardian finds the kill. Great shot from the op and they'll get another one. That's going to be up to seven. Yeah, it was about time Guardian woke up on this match. He's down to, he's only got seven frags right now and uh, being as, as dominant player as he is usually, he really needs to step it up. He got the early pick there on Cat and then the last kill there in B. So Guardian really needs to show up here if, if Navi really want to have this comeback happen. But yeah, just good plays there. Navi playing very similar to uh, what Flipside did on their CT and uh, just taking the play to the middle and then um, get, getting those early two kills. So uh, playing a huge part in securing that seventh round. And they're stacked inside apartments again this time. World Edit mans up, tries to come be the first one in. But they've got smoked off. They've also smoked it out deep as well. So there's two smokes on the B apartments right now. Seized is just going to wait though. He's on the back side of the van. Free candy for kids out of that van, and Seized wants to give it all away. As Blade and Markalov have other plans, they've gone to underpass. They'll smoke out Zeus. If he pushes forward, though, that second smoke's slowly going to be going away, and he might get the shot. Edward's already found Simple. Again, Simple, no entries this time. He hasn't been able to come on just yet, and Seized is going to go further. He catches World Edit. Blade goes down as well, and Markalov's got to do this job again. He brought it down so close last round, but... There's no openings this time, and in fact, they don't even have the bomb to work with, and Seized is going to catch him, or does he? He just gets below the wall in time. Guardian finds him instead, but Bondic has Flamey. But Bondic only has himself to work with. Forever alone, and forever dead. Guardian gets the kill. And Na'Vi are looking strong now, finally, on their CT side. And the question is, when does Simple arrive back in the game? Because yeah. he and World Edit haven't found a kill in about four rounds going now. That's what I was going to say, Maybe five. Too. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. As long as Simple is is, is keep kept uh, on a leash like that, Flipside is going to have, have a lot of trouble getting those rounds that they need. And Navi just doing a very good job so far, actually, on CT. I'm surprised how well they've gathered themselves, being as they have in such a grim situation, but so far, so good for Navi. And uh, they can just keep stringing these rounds together. You never know what's going to happen here. Smoke's going to go over. They want to go for this rush. They've only got the one tech nine. Simple's on the deagle this time. Markalov, 35. Blade, 51. Smoke's going to come in to counter this. He's going to put out the fire as well. Smoke's deep. Fire close. They'll run through one into the other, and Seized already spams away. That's Simple down. Markalov does respond. At least one into Edward. But Guardian's already put a nade in, and that's Markalov to drop. And Guardian's going to do more than that. The op comes up big. They will take it out of his hands, but they'll pick that back up. No issues there, and it's almost up to 14-9. Well, it is up to 14-9. It's almost up to 14-10. Double digits both teams. So this is not done because Flipside aren't finding openings. And if Na'Vi pull this off, I will be damned. It will be a heck of a comeback, and it'll just add to the absolute weird performances we've seen tonight. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I think Flipside here, 
the ball is in their court. They need to change up their play. They definitely haven't had any success there in the middle. And I think the, similar to what I asked from Na'Vi, they need to have some straight up plays to either the bomb sides and try to make those work instead of trying to grind that middle control. Because right now, the CTs have definitely dictated that middle play, giving Terrace no room whatsoever to work with the middle. Na'Vi, Edward, Catwalk. Aggressive, trying to find a pick. There's the first he does. It's World Edit goes down, so again they can't find anything. Makes it work right off the round so far. I'll see T. And Simple's coming from underpass. He's done it every round and already looking away. And Zeus fires into him. He needs to look the right way. He's not. He keeps checking his back. He's not 100% certain he's safe. The good news is Zeus has fallen off the angle. So now we'll have to do the battle with Edward instead. And that's off first. AK, who's going to get the better shot? Obviously the op. Edward takes him down. So another round. World edit. Simple out early. And it's Markalov that has to step up if they want any chance into this. He's rushing toward B and he's already welcomed. Edward, so smart. His rotation's on point. And he's got three. He's got all three so far. And they've got to change things up. Flipside can't keep going with the same tactic. They keep walking into a mid-slaughter. They have. And they really, really need to ch change it up. Otherwise, it's going to slip out of hand for them. This would be a disastrous meltdown if they don't win it. Yeah. They have to win it. They had this at 14-2 with Pistol and... Na'Vi are looking so poised. Look at the money on their side. It's absolutely massive. They're all on to five digits before the buy. And they've got to change it. They've got to go to A. They have to. I mean, World Edit hasn't found a pick. Simple keeps walking up and losing the fight in mid because World Edit's down before that. There's no support on him and he can't find the pick. They've got to try something different and they will. Finally, they're going to look toward A. Yeah, and they're speeding things up too. And they are very fast. They're already in. Smokes aren't even out, but Markalov's already on Tetris. Flash is holding him back. Simple's this time already in the site. He's at the firebox, but he's spotted. This time he gets a kill. Flamey does go down. It's Markalov out before that, and Zeus is forced off. The smokes are real. Very, very real and very thick indeed. Su seized at least does get played. But Simple's still lurking, and he's going forward. He knows Guardian's on the other side of these smokes, and he just has to sit tight. The bomb's yet to be planted, and they're going to get them all. Flipside still can't get anything, and we are three rounds different. Navi is doing this. Yeah, by the looks of it, I never believed it would happen, but they seem to be able to grind it out. And now Flipside is, is ending up in this vicious cycle of uh, force buying every round. I think they should have probably saved one of these rounds to pick up an op again. And then try a slow execution towards a site. Now that was just an A rush. Didn't work at all. Navi just took care of business. And uh, yeah, now it's time for a slow execution towards a site, I believe. It should be, but it's not happening so far. And they're inside Flipside's head at this point. We yeah, said there was are. no pressure. Now there's full pressure. This <laughs> is normally the side they get their rounds on Mirage. And so far, they've only got one. They haven't found anything. They did a good job on CT. Maybe it's a curse. Maybe their luck comes from not being a performing CT team. So they'll slow it down big time. They got into the site last time, but they couldn't secure it. So they'll look for a better execution. Markalov's going to lurk over toward your B apartments, but the rest of them are setting up for A. They've given up on mid entirely. Zeus has been strong in the connector. He may not have a lot of kills to his name. He's got 14, but he's had the impact frags in this half, and Guardian's been supporting him well. But it's Flamey and Zeus that'll come under fire first. That first smoke's already out. Zeus will get on the stairway. He'll see above it. And Simple wants to make these shots count. His entries tonight, aside from this half, have been absolutely amazing. And already he takes a bit of damage, but does fire away. And it's Flamey down. He gets him on the second tie. And now World Edit contributes. They both got kills. And this might be just enough. Flip side in. Blades planning. Seized comes around from CT. Edward comes through the vent. He's already through before World Edit can get into position, though, so no di disadvantage on the movement speed. That gives him the kill to go back to Navi right now. As Simple looks for more, and he might get it. He does. Spray control is successful. Seized the drop, and it's just Edward and Guardian left. They've got two ops, and they can stick around to go for this because they've got all kinds of money, but it's just going to be Guardian now. He might actually decide not to. He just wants to hurt the economy, if anything, and he will. He gets Blade. That's one more down for flip side, and more money that goes away from... F3, but they're going to be on match point after this round. They finally got that elusive 15, and maybe that's enough to push them over. And again, it was finally simple in World Edit. Both contribute. That's the difference so far. Yeah, and the slow execution towards A side. It worked. Worked in their favor. And uh, definitely simple, obviously. Getting those picks. I think he killed maybe even three guys in that round. Played a huge role in, in flip side picking up that round. And uh, yeah, now if the only, pro only problem right now here is if, if should Navi take this round. They're actually not that far away from uh, clinching that overtime because that would be flip side would be horrible in terms of money. So this round here is it's actually very, very important in that regard.
And they'll slow it down again. Simple's going to go to your A main or your ramp. Call it what you will. World Edit's inside Palace. Bondic is directly behind him. Markalov still not sure if he wants to go down the underpass or wait for Edward to perhaps get impatient over on the B balcony. That's where he's playing right now as Blade grabs the bomb. He'll go back toward A. So Zeus is waiting. They do have this op out for him as well as for Edward. It's not Guardian that's going to be holding one, or is it? My mistake. It is Guardian. Flamey's already dropped down. It's Zeus with an auto sniper. I saw him scoped in. I thought it might have been an off, but it's an auto sniper, and he uses it well. Simple's already off the map. He's relieved. But I'm not sure Flipside will be, because without him, they've had struggles getting into bomb sites. Guardian's going to find World Edit. So again, both of them go down with no kills. That's been a huge impact right now in this game. And Edwards pushed up. He finds Blade. Quick shot with the CZ-75. He goes for the knife because he's out of ammo in the magazine. And Markalov gets him as a result. That brings it back to only a one-man advantage. But Guardian extinguishes Markalov already. Get the eraser and forget he ever existed. And he'll do the same with Bondic. And it's only three rounds spread. Flipside. It's tense. Will they force or not? That's the question. And the best bet would be to save because they yeah. still have match points to play for. If they don't, they'll force throw this away and bring it back way too close. They should definitely save at this point. They know the money for Navi is out of control for them. That doesn't really matter at this point. All they got to play for right now is to make sure they have enough money for doing whatever they like to do. But on that round, Edward's timing on how he pushed Kitchen played a huge role in that, in that round going into Navi's way. Had he not been able to get to Kitchen before... Those two guys got in. Could have been all different. Well, let it get seized. So this time he does have a kill, but they don't have the firepower to support it. Zeus goes back. That's simple down again. And Flamey gets Bondic as well. Blade falls immediately after. Flamey with the double. Edward throws this nade. He saw him cross over, so they'll just do the early damage onto World Edit. He's on 11, and he's got far less than that as the op will take him from there down the rest of the way. Sub-Zero onto him, and... Uh, now it's only two rounds, and as we mentioned, they'll go back to the weapons. World Edit's going to go for the op, but they need to find these picks early. They've only got two rounds this half. Yeah, and uh, it's been their A place that have th that, that's been the only ones that have been successful so far. So see if they opt to do that again, or if they feel they have a strength somewhere else on the map. The crazy thing about this half is that Simple's still on 29. He's only found about four frags in this half in general. Yeah. Make that five, actually. I think it was 24 at half, but... No less, it just highlights how good he has been, but now that they found a way to counter him and he's gone silent, look at the difference it's making. So either the rest of Flipside need to pick, pick it up or he just needs to find one more huge round and secure this series for them because, again, they've got the 2-1 lead in maps. And it would be all over if this is tense. Na'Vi is fighting their way back into this to try and force it to Inferno. And after a meltdown like this from Flipside, you'd have to say the mental edge might go their way. And if they pull off this comeback, and that's going to be what happens, how incredible of a story would that be? And how heartbreaking for Flipside. And that's why we love Counter-Strike. It gives you a bit of everything, and right now it's giving you more than that. As it's another slow performance right now, another slow round for Flipside. Bondic and Palace, Blade waiting outside the A-Main. World Edit looking for the op shot onto Edward. He actually tags him up. He's down to 36, but he wants more. He's going to push forward. He's got to be careful. There's two waiting for him, and the fire's going to go out. That pushes him back, and that might actually be a saving grace because there's so many more nades looking at him, and he's already down to 50 HP. He might be sticking around too long. He needs to get away. Why is he not joining on A? I know he wants to hold these rotators in place, but right now they just need to take one sight. That's all they need is one take. And Blade's going in. Flamey's in shadow. Bondic's not coming in to support. Blade does get the kill. That's huge. As Guardian still waits on Catwalk. Pardon me, in jungle. As he gets flashed off and he can't find anything. Markaloth finds Zeus. Simple's been removed, but World Edit's still around. C's going to come from Catwalk, and this bomb is going to go down, or does it? It does not! Guardian, that's huge! He gets played before it gets in place, and they do it! They hold it out because of that, and Na'Vi's within one! Unbelievable comeback right now! Na'Vi! Against all odds, the composure is utterly ridiculous. This is huge. Guardian getting that pick. Probably saved them here. Because <laughs> the bomb obviously went down. Um, wasn't able to plan it. Flip side and uh, yeah, just this is just a naughty comeback we're seeing from um, Navi at this point, and that's gonna put Flip side in a situation where they're force buying. They are, they're working with one AK and four pistols, plenty of nades to work with though. So let's see what they have in store for us. What a match this has turned out to be! 14-2 at one point.
for Flipside Tactics with the second round pistol and an eco starts the most incredible comeback. We thought VPTSM was good at Star Series. This is equally on the same page right now. And look at the gun setup. Again, Zeus going for this auto sniper and it's double op to complement it with only two M4s for Seized and Flamey. And Seized is inside B, Flamey's up close at A, so they're gonna put those to the test on those choke points. At flip side, have to be at a loss for words. Definitely. This is a bitter pill to swallow. And already Guardians got Blade World and it goes down as well. Edward gets him and they're not getting the openings whatsoever. They can't find any angles and Navi's just waiting for them to walk out and it's just destroying them. Bondic wants more. He might find Flamey. This time he does check the angle. So they've got an opening to A. Simple's going to come around. He's still up. That's crucial as Bondic finds Zeus as well. So double. And he's going to push forward. He's going to secure beyond the site. He gets three. Bondic. This is a hero round from him. Forget Simple. It might be all up to Bondic to carry them across the finish line. As Edward finally counters him but seized. Or pardon me. Edward is under pressure now from Simple. Markolov takes down Seized. And it's all up to Edward. It's so close yet so far. It's a one on two and can he do it? He's got time ticking away against him and that flash will deter this even further. He's on one HP and have they done enough? Has Bondic stepped up when he needs to and Simple closes it out. How fitting is that? But 16, 14 and flip side. Hold on, my goodness, what a night of Counter-Strike. They go through so adding to the VP win, they take down Na'Vi, although Na'Vi was questionable at times, they played Insane right there in that half. They did. I think both teams just sh showcased an amazing CT half on Mirage. Middle, uh, Taurus, either either side had no place in middle as Taurus. Like, they, they had nothing going for them. It was Guardian on the second half just dominating there. Uh, it was simple and world edit while flip side was CT. It was just, yeah, nothing was going for the Taurus tonight. I don't like this whole series has been so hard to talk about because <laughs> everything that's happened's just been insane. Obviously, simple leads the way again. Four matches, 114 kills. That's ridiculous. 63 deaths only. KD 1.8 over a five best of five. Four maps played, so four maps, 1.8 kills per round, 1.1 and 44% headshot. That might be the most complete series I've seen from a player in a very long time. Now it is online, so we can't give it as much credit as if it's at LAN, but still, that's insane. That is insane, and uh, I'm lost for words when it comes to simple at, at this point. I've never seen anyone really be that remarkable throughout a best of five series. I've seen amazing maps from people, but I've rarely ever seen as big of a performance throughout a best of five or a best of three even from a player. And some of the accuracy in the shots he had. I mean, Cash, insane. Cobble, insane when he it's walked out from B. Yeah, it's just a combination of the way he's uh, just he's shooting abilities, but also just the instinctive plays he does. He just reads the game so well as well. So he's he's a pretty much a complete package. Not to forget his opping abilities, too. That's right. He normally goes for the second op setup. They haven't been running that tonight because why would you when he's on fire like that? And we may still see him on land because now they play Fnatic in a best of five tomorrow night. Winner of that, straight through to DreamHack Bucharest to join in with NIP, Envious, and TSM. And speaking of TSM, they almost choked in a similar fashion tonight, but they get away with it in four maps. If this went to Inferno <laughs> after a comeback like that, it would have been entirely unpredictable again. Yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't think... I think it would have been... I think it would have, would have been uh, flip side out of the picture at that point because throwing away a lead like that, how do you come back from it mentally? <laughs> you just don't. It would have been all Navi. That's when I get angry and just buy shotguns and every round and run forward. <laughs> would have been all Navi. Utterly ridiculous. So we'll do this giveaway to our subscribers. Thank you all so much for subscribing. And uh, it's the AK Wasteland Rebel. We're resetting it. No, that's a cancel. Don't troll us like that, production. There it is. So the winner is Faithion42. Did I say that right, Faithion? I'm going to go with that. No? Yeah, it should be all right. Sure. All right, Faithion42, you get the AK-47 Wasteland Rebel. Thank you for subscribing and contributing to the prize pool as well. The team certainly appreciate it. And on that note, thank you, everyone, for tuning in. That was an amazing series, and the Ukrainian pride goes the way of Flipside. They now play Fnatic. It's a double left battle for one spot in Bucharest. We'll it's gonna be good. Night. It's gonna be good. Stick around. Finish night round. I think Korea is way more entertaining. I haven't done it in a while.
So, place your bet. Sniper, I'm gonna get started and already they're working up in toward the A site right now. World Epic can be the first one up over top of Tetris. Still looking at the face of Guardian and they stare at each other down. So pretty the eyes and they want to adore them a little bit longer as the iris expands as that fight comes in and the pain's already in place. They're both down on health and now they're gonna run toward the A site. Markov does get Edward, but Zeus comes right back and the God of War showing off that he can use his sword as much as a gun and that's gonna make it back to a four on four situation. But the damage is still going the way of Navi right now. Cancel that back. How come there's a decoy egg going out? That will do damage when it explodes. However, no one's close enough by to make it impact. Well, on the round as Markov does get Guardian. Now it's just flaming left. In fact, he's going to go down. It's Seize uh, who actually finds himself all by himself. One on three. He's going to get the first. Can he get more? He does get two. And if he makes this one on three, it would be an absolutely incredible career round because it's going to be as exciting as ever. Bonding down with 12 HP. He's down the disadvantage, but he gets him. He dodges that first wipe and he goes back into it. And now flip side tactics have three out of the four knife rounds and they'll start out on the CT side. There we go. And after Bondic's the one with the kill. Zeus. Comes back one more, but here's Simple. He's already arrived, and it's a double for him to close out the round. And flip side, CT side, have the first round. The second player to hold the attention so he can walk out and get the slaughter, but they're already falling into his crosshair. Seized is the first to go. Markalov holds strong. Simple's going to get it from the other side of the site, so they've each found one. Markalov finds another. World edit onto Zeus, and now it's all just flaming. He has picked up the AK. Does get the first. Make it two now. He gets World edit as well. 42 HP still left, and Markalov's just too patient. There's no pulling him out. Gonna rush it in toward B this time. Navi's gonna shut them down. Blade, Markalov, just walk into the spam from the A1. Zeus can't connect, he can't close it out. The M4 not powerful enough. So Blade's opened it up. Now they can pinch on the site. Bondic has gone down. That's crucial because there's no HP left for World Edit. So they'll get away with the round. But that almost came back.